friend. I'm Laura Burgels, and I'm coming at you from my home office in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And I'm here with a confession. I overuse the word that. Now, there's nothing wrong with the word that, but I overuse and often misuse the word. And maybe you can recognize yourself in this too. I'll say something like this. I told her that she did a great job. Now, I don't need to say that. All I need to say is, I told her she did a great job. It's more concise. I don't need the unnecessary, unnecessary syllable. But to this day, I'm working to eliminate my that's from my writing. Twitter, with the 140 character limitation, that's helped me curb my that addiction. And if I'm editing a long piece of work, I will go out of my way to search and destroy my habitual overuses of the word that. But when it comes to saying it in my day-to-day -day speech, I'm having a really hard time getting rid of it. The word just leaps out of my mouth unbidden. How did it get so bad? I'm blaming my dad. He was born on April Fool's Day and was a bit of a joker. And he told me a joke when I was around seven years old that obviously made a bit of an impression because it stuck. Now here's dad's joke. He said, Laura, imagine that you're in class and you're sitting next to a little girl whose name you don't know. And the teacher points to her and says, use the word that in a sentence. So the little girl points at you and she says, I like that girl. So then the teacher interrogates me and says, hey, did that girl use the word that correctly? And according to dad, my response should be, I believe that 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 that, that girl used is correct. What I'm saying is this, dad jokes have consequences, people. It's decades later and I still abuse the word that. I'm working to solve my problem. If you have any suggestions, I'd be happy to hear them. I'd also be happy to hear about any new and amazing ways to use the word that more than five times consecutively and still have it make sense in a sentence. Happy birthday, Dad, and happy April Fool's Day.